again so much for clicking on this video. Welcome back to my channel or welcome if you're new here. My name is Tina and I post cleaning and homemaking videos to help motivate you to get everything that you need to do done, which is exactly what I'm doing today, getting everything done because James has been sick. So the house of course has been neglected for the past week. So today I'm just picking everything up. We're gonna cook some dinner. I have an Amazon Fresh grocery haul for you, a little bit of a Target haul, and we're just gonna try and get everything done that we can that we've been unable to do since James was sick. So I hope this video today will give you some motivation. I hope you could get up and clean with me, keep me on in the background. And if you enjoy this video, please make sure to like and subscribe. Only a few minutes later and those magnets are already back on the fridge but that's okay these magnets honestly not the biggest fan I only got them because I like that the whole back is a magnet so I don't have to worry about him eating or choking on a magnet um, but they're like paper on top so when he puts them in his mouth they're already getting ruined and we just got them so I'm in the living room. Let me know if you have any ideas for this shelf in here, for these two shelves, because I don't know how to keep anything on here anymore. That's why it's like, it kind of looks just a little, everything is out of place. Well, aside from all this stuff up here, it's become a dumping ground, that's for sure. Um, and then I end up just moving stuff all the way to the top that he can't get, like that bowl and the phone in the bowl. And I just decided I'm just gonna start taking the stuff off and not even keeping it there anymore. Like the lamp is going, this is going, the phone is going. Um, so he can't pull anything down. And I just don't know how to decorate these shelves that are toddler friendly. Um, the lamp I really wanted to keep there, but the plug is right under the first shelf on the bottom. And you're gonna see in a minute, he is constantly putting his hands down there trying to get at it and pull it and I just don't want him getting electrocuted so I said you know what I'm just gonna take it off but please let me know if you have any ideas because I would love to decorate this nicely I just can't think of how honestly so in a minute I'm gonna head into the kitchen my Amazon fresh has showed up so I'm gonna show you everything that I got there just do a little overview of the table but first I'm gonna show you a couple items that I picked up from Target as well 
So at Target, I just got some Cheez-Its. I got these apple sweet potato blueberry fruit pouches. No added sugar. James really seems to like them. He hadn't had them before. And then they started selling the Little Bellies brand. So they were basically all sold out except for these two things. So that's exciting to pick those up because he loves them. So over on Amazon Fresh's side, he didn't really like those jammy sammies, which was surprising because I thought they're pretty good. But I just got some more peanut butter. These Jeff's Garden jalapeno peppers and the banana pepper rings, they're so good. You have to try both of them. I love them both. I wanted to get the Happy Belly Mayo because it was so cheap and I want to see if it's as good as Hellman's and spoiler alert, it is. Um, picked up some more bread, Dave's Killer Bread. That's what I've been trying to go for. Uh, I got some bagels as you can see. Those are pretty good. And of course the Happy Belly Flour Tortillas. Delicious. I'm going to use those for dinner in this video. James loves those Lesser Evil Puffs and I love their popcorn. I love these late July sea salt and lime chips. They're so good. I got some veggie, veggie straws because I want to see if James liked those. And I got Bobby Gala apples because they were on sale this week. So he hasn't complained yet. So we'll see. Some iceberg lettuce that I got to put on top of the enchiladas for dinner. Totally forgot. So didn't use it. Um, and then just some cheese, some chive and onion cream cheese, my new favorite sour cream. I've been loving it. So good. Way better than Daisy. I got this cinnamon sugar butter for my mom. I, I tried it too. It's pretty good. Um, just our regular fruit, you know, bananas, blueberries, strawberries, and then these Zevia cream sodas are so good. I've been on a Zevia kick lately because I was on a poppy kick and listen, I just can't be buying poppy every single day. So Zevia it is. So now I'm just headed into the kitchen. I'm going to start making dinner and doing some cleaning throughout. But for dinner tonight, I'm making enchiladas. I'm using ground chicken. I'm going to cut an onion up. I usually always do that, but I usually use red enchilada sauce. So I was kind of winging it. Wasn't sure how it was going to come out, if it was going to be the same or not. But it was actually really good. Bobby said it was my best batch of enchiladas yet. And I think I agree. I really like it. Um, it has a little tiny bit of spice to it, which is good, but nothing crazy. I somehow cut my finger, but not even on the knife. It was when I was trying to get the onion peel off of the onion. I, I really don't know, but uh, fix that up. <laughs> and yeah, just going to make some dinner, clean up, and definitely recommend trying this recipe out. It was very good. And the A Plenty green enchilada sauce, that's from Amazon Fresh. That's an Amazon brand. I'm thinking you were made for me. It's in my birthday yet, yeah, cause I gotta say, you're looking like a gift for me. Wrapped up nice and neat, baby. Get in my way now, don't be shy. We'll be here dancing day and night. Get in my groove now, don't be shy. Cause I got this list of my favorite things. You could be the part where it all begins. You could be the first and the second and the third and the rest of. Baby, I will show you how you can catch my vibe And right away I so much time Looping in the blurry lights So I forgot to hit record when I was filling the tortillas, but all I did was 
put some meat in the tortilla, roll it up, and put it in the pan, and that was it. Uh, they came out so good, definitely gonna make again. And now I'm just gonna go into the pantry, put the stuff away from my grocery order. I have been keeping the pantry so clean. It's been so great. I'm so happy that we did it. Um, if you haven't seen that video, definitely check it out. I filmed the whole thing from beginning to end of us making over at pantry, but it has been so nice having everything so organized and like I thought it was, it is just so much easier to keep clean. Light colored furniture and floors is just as bad as black colored furniture. You can see so much on this coffee table. I really love it and I love the way it looks and everything, um, but unfortunately <laughs> you are you really can see Freddy's dog hair so well on it because it's black, but it's fine. Um, so I'm just cleaning up the living room. You're gonna see the shelves in a minute. I feel like I got them organized pretty well. I mean, for what is left on there. I just need to, I feel like, take everything that's on there off and just get all new stuff that is toddler friendly again. So please, if you have any ideas, send them my way because I would love to know. So I wanted to mention um, what days I'm gonna be uploading. I had every intention of sticking with two times a week, but it has just been really difficult to keep up with doing that and trying to stay consistent at all like on Instagram or anything and then doing Etsy and Amazon it's just been a lot and then when James was sick that like all went out the window because I couldn't really do anything um so it's just been difficult so what I think I'm going to do because I really need to focus a lot more on my Amazon stuff is that I think I'm going to just post once a week on YouTube um, I don't know if it's going to be like a set day or what I would like it to be, but I don't want to hold myself to it and say it's going to be, and then it's not. And then I feel guilt about it. So for now, I'm definitely going to be doing once a week until I get into a new groove and routine of how to do everything. And once I'm able to do that, then I'm hoping that I'll be able to get back to posting twice a week again. When I'm going out, you 
be there Cause everything reminds me of you I can't take no more Girl, I think I'm losing my mind Try to go to work, but I lost track of time Cause everyone keep looking like you I can't take no more I miss your touch From your hands and your body It hurts so much To think of you as someone else Can't get enough When you're sweet talking to me Now I'm talking sweet all by myself Put your arms around me, put your faith in me, put your love on me What you need from me, need your love on me, put your love on me I'ma do everything for you, I don't want anyone but you Put your arms around me, put your faith in me, put your love on me Can we stop the clock and rewind, go back to that moment in time When you say you want me for life, was it all a lie? Talking to me Now I'm talking sweet all by myself Put your arms around me Put your faith in me Put your love on me What you need from me Need your love on me Put your love on me I'ma do everything for you I don't want anyone but you Put your arms around me Put your faith in me Put your love on me So I'm just putting the house to bed now and then I'm going to put myself to bed. That does it for today's video. I really hope I was able to give you some motivation to get done whatever you need to get done. Please make sure to subscribe if you enjoyed this video and I will see you all next time. Bye.